Hi, everybody. Welcome to our Meet Fit for a Baby live interview with me, Jessica Maurer, the Director of Instructor Development here at Fit for Mom. I want to introduce you to our two amazing franchisees today. This is Rebecca from Fit for Mom Madison, Alabama, and this is Allison from Fit for Mom Oak Park River Forest. Hi, ladies. Hello. Hi. Thank you guys so much for joining me today as we are going to walk through what Fit for Baby is. Now, if you haven't met Fit for Mom yet, hi everyone. Fit for Mom is a pre and postnatal fitness and community wellness and everything, all of the above community across the nation for moms of all ages and stages of motherhood. Our Fit for Baby is a six week program where we are gonna introduce you to moms just like you across your community to make sure that you have some geographical support as well as support from the Fit for Mom leaders of your industry. So we're gonna go through a couple of questions for Rebecca and for Allison so that they can tell you a little bit more from Fit for Baby from their perspectives, um, being franchise owners, being instructors, being moms, because Fit for Mom is for moms and by moms. And that's pretty special about what we do here. So question number one that I'm gonna ask you guys is, as a Fit for Baby leader, what is your favorite aspect of the Fit for Baby program? I'm gonna take it to you first, Allison. Uh, my favorite aspect is really instilling a sense of community and support for mothers. Uh, the opportunity to meet moms um, at the same stage of motherhood to commiserate in everything that comes along with the physical and emotional aspects of pregnancy uh, to share advice is, is really a huge part of, of caring for, for other women during this time. Absolutely. And what about you, Rebecca? Oh, um, I think my favorite is definitely the invitation that you get in that six weeks to be very mindful, listen to your body, and most importantly, connect with your baby. As moms, as women, we're leading very, very busy lives, whether that is you're at work and work meetings or running around after a toddler. My favorite right now is the dreaded school line stress. Um, but we don't often get a moment to just just take a moment. So I love uh, when I'm at class, I get to look around and I can see my mom's eyes closed, hands on my belly. And I know in that moment that they are connected and present with themselves, but more importantly, with their baby. So that is my favorite special moment that um, I feel really lucky to just be a part of. Those are beautiful answers. So to let you guys know a little bit more about what Fit for Baby is, it's a six week program that's going to incorporate movement, an accountability group where you're gonna be able to support other moms just like you and receive support from moms. In addition to that, we have an amazing bump book that's gonna help you track your pregnancy and weekly emails that's gonna keep you informed as to what's happening and when, what we want you to be thinking about, some extra tips and resources and some love to share with you, our prenatal mamas. So as both of these ladies just mentioned, support is a really big aspect of what we offer here at Fit for Baby. Each week that you go through our Fit for Baby program, we actually offer a different theme. So all of our classes, our education, our weekly posts are all centered around one big part of pregnancy. And we actually designed this to answer the questions that we receive most often at Fit for Mom. Like, can I still exercise while I'm pregnant? Even things such as like nutrition, what should I be eating based on what trimester I'm in? What do I need? We talk about mindfulness as well and how you can help relieve that anxiety or maybe depression that you may be experiencing throughout your pregnancy. We talk about your emotional health and how hormones can really influence how you're feeling and how you can adapt to that. We talk about the changing of your body because as you know, if you've ever been pregnant, you can wake up one day and feel amazing and the next day maybe not quite so much. So we talk a lot about why that is and where it is. And the last week we spend on helping you take your next step, whether that's planning through your birth prep, whether that's getting your prepared for what your next trimester is, whether it's coming back for another fun for baby, or excuse me, fit for baby session, we talk you through. I'm going to give you a little preview now of what we're talking about so that you can kind of see how it works in terms of your accountability group. So you'll be put into a private group with other mamas just like you. As you can see here, this is kind of our little cheat sheet that walks you through what the post is going to be about as well as what the week is going to be about. So the first week we know is all about your physical health. On day one, we're going to talk about cardio that's safe for you to do in every, every age and stage of pregnancy. We'll talk about the benefits of exercise throughout pregnancy. 
we're always going to make sure we check in with you, see how you're feeling and allow for a ton of communication to happen between you and the other mamas. We give you a lot of resources, everything from education on pelvic floor and DRA. We provide uh, recipes for you and information about food that can help you through this stage of pregnancy. And we make sure that we always celebrate our wins together as a team on Fridays, bringing back this idea of every week we have something to celebrate. It's a great time to celebrate with other moms, making sure that you're giving high fives and they're giving high fives. And it's a big community kind of big, heavy love fest. So we have tons of information that we share with you each week, whether again, it's something about trimester one, two, and three, whether it's something that can cover all three trimesters or helping you learn how to alleviate some of the issues or pains that you may be experiencing through pregnancy. We do this all through a lens of strength and united in motherhood, bringing the love together through everything. I'm gonna take it back over to our lovely ladies now, and we're gonna be talking about from the Fit for Baby perspective, what component, uh, what ingredient of Fit for Baby has, have you seen benefits your moms the most? And I'm going to go over to you first, Rebecca. Yeah. So um, for me, it's, it's that support, all those kind of things that you touched on just then. I really love, I kind of get actually like really, really giddy when I get one of those questions either in class or on our support page and in our group chat about not necessarily the workout, but something more about pelvic floor or somebody says that they want a specific birth plan or they want to breastfeed, but they don't know where to start and they're anxious. And so then I get to geek out and give them all the tips and tricks and tell them about the local doula that I love or tell them about the pelvic floor therapist that I personally used or um, point them in the direction of the breastfeeding group. So they get that aspect, but they then also have all these other mamas around them many of whom are not first time moms, they've been in their shoes, they had those same burning questions. So then they get to also share their first hand experience. And all the information becomes um, really crucial for that mama to be empowered in their own wellness and um, really advocate for themselves during their pregnancy in those nine months, but then beyond that into their motherhood journey as well. So I love those questions. And I love that we have that place to do them on both the in-class or in the virtual space um, and also in our group chat. It, it really, that's where for me, the gold dust is, maybe. Awesome. What about you, Allison? What component have you seen really benefits the majority of your moms? I think the, the community aspect for sure. Um, having a safe space to come work out in is meaningful, but uh, holding a, a space for moms to connect with each other is powerful. I think moms need that time to, to compare notes, to talk about how they're feeling, um, to talk through the changes that are going on in their lives as a result of their pregnancy. Um, it's really a unique opportunity and I'm not aware of anything like it. I mean, when, when you're pregnant, there's those classes you can go to through your hospital about breastfeeding, about um, you know, preparing for labor and delivery but there's really nothing that provides sort of ongoing uh, can group connection and, and support. I think another important aspect is just this ability to share resources. Um, and that can range from finding a pediatrician and a pelvic floor physical therapist to, uh, for me, when I participated in the program, it was uh, figuring out that Rent the Runway offered um, maternal uh, maternity options. <laughs> so that allowed me to go to a, a work event when I was um, 37 weeks pregnant without having to purchase, you know, a new, a new dress. Um, I so. love that. <laughs> and what's amazing about Allison's journey is Allison started off as a fit for baby client and now owns her own business. So starting off as Fit for Mom as a mover and a groover in our classes to a business owner just a few years later. So thank you for joining us and, and being part of our franchise ownership as well. And if you're interested in learning more about owning a franchise, make sure you reach out to us at Fit for Mom. We'd love to be able to help you find your next step in your business. So something that Allison touched upon is that safe space for workouts. And Fit for Baby, while it is a six-week program, and we do have this accountability and support group that takes you through the questions that you may have and puts you with the support of the other moms in ages and stages similar to you, we also have the fitness component. 
because that's what we do at Fit for Mom. As I told you about in the beginning, we're the pre and postnatal fitness experts. While we do have community and we do unite motherhood or people in um, motherhood through strength and motherhood, that's what I'm trying to say. We also have the fitness component and the Fit for Baby class is very specifically created to speak to the needs of all prenatal moms, whether you're trimester one, two, or three. We have cardio endurance, we have strength conditioning, and we have core balance. We also lead our moms through a birth prep series, which is exactly what it sounds like, teaching you how to move in order to prepare you for whatever birth you choose. We work a lot on stability and mobility because we know that that's what moms need in pregnancy. Now, we won't get too far in the weeds describing what the exercise classes are, but we can tell you that they're really fun. You'll have a good time. You'll definitely get a great workout in and you'll be supported by moms who understand what your body's going through right now. In creating Fit for Baby, we worked with everyone from OBGYNs to doulas. We worked with birth prep coaches from all different sides of um, birthing. And we wanted to make sure that we touched upon as many different aspects as we possibly could for our prenatal clients. So when you come to a Fit for Baby class, not only are you in a safe place, but you're in safe hands as well which is pretty important to us at Fit for Mom. All right, guys. So what, as a mama, what part of this program has helped you the most? And I'm going to go to you first, Allison. Uh, just like you said, uh, the, the workouts are very intentional. Uh, and the strength training that you do through the workouts really help to balance out some of the changes that are happening in, in your body during pregnancy. Uh, so an example would be, you know, core training, which, which actually entails really strengthening the hip and the, the glute muscles. Um, and also, you know, one of the interesting aspects I found was uh, tips about transitioning from, for example, standing to the floor. Uh, no, one, no one tells you those things during your, your pregnancy. So I always found those tips to be really helpful for uh, just everyday life during pregnancy. I love it. What about you, Rebecca? Yeah, I just loved having that safe place, the peace of mind, knowing that that workout was following ACOG guidelines, that I had an instructor who was specially trained um, and had experience working with prenatal women as well. Um, and then for me, it was also just having a judgment-free space. As I progressed in my pregnancy, I wasn't able to do things you know that I could do before I was pregnant so knowing that I had a safe space to ask for a modification and not be judged for it or somebody you know kind of think that keep going keep going keep going you know they knew exactly what I needed in that moment um that was really really powerful and then also just knowing that I was not going to be judged on the number of potty breaks that I needed in that 60 minutes <laughs> um that was probably the most awesome thing. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, we at Vet for Mom, we empower you through choice. Throughout our workouts, as Rebecca and Allison just shared, you have a lot of choice. We guide you through the workout, but you really can choose how you're feeling each day because we know from being moms ourselves that some days you're going to wake up and that workout is going to be amazing. And some days you're going to crawl on the floor and that's okay. We're here to support you every step of the way. The Fit for Mom education process makes sure that our instructors stay up to date with the latest information coming out about prenatal training. As Allison mentioned before, we understand how the body changes throughout each stage of pregnancy. And we want to make sure that that's strongly represented in our classes. We make sure that it's a safe space, as Rebecca told you before, and that allows for us to really guide you through a workout that's appropriate for where you are in pregnancy. We make sure that we teach moms things that no one else is going to teach her. Like, how do you stand up once you're on the floor and you're in your third month, or excuse me, your third trimester? How do you get up from this position? We actually have incorporated that into the Fit for Baby class that will teach you how to transition safely through all of the different stages of standing, kneeling, on the ground, and so on and so forth to keep you safe and healthy as well as your baby, because we want you to be able to move throughout pregnancy and come back to us after your birth. We make sure that with our education that we do follow ACOG guidelines and that is the OBGYN Association of America, but we also make sure that we follow through with other styles of fitness training to make sure that we are really focused on the total wellness package for our prenatal moms. We wanna make sure that we're keeping everyone 
safe and moving, giving them a really great workout as well. Again, no matter what trimester you're in, the Fur Baby has a home for you. All right, ladies, that's gonna take us into our next question of in that support group that we showed you earlier, what's your favorite weekly focus that we talk about? And I'm gonna head over to you first, Allison. So I, I will admit I'm a little biased because I'm also a psychologist, um, but I have to say just the, the mental health aspect. Um, there's some great resources that, you know, that we provide like mindfulness, but I think just the fact that Fit for Baby introduces this topic and it, it opens the door for moms to come back and to talk further or, or ask for resources if they do need more support you know, further down their pregnancy or, or postpartum. Yeah, absolutely. And Rebecca? Uh, yeah, I'm the same. I love the mental health week. I think it's something that we don't talk about um, during pregnancy or motherhood enough in general. Um, so I love that we get to start to introduce moms to ways to cope with burnout and stress and give them the tools that they can then use, you know, hopefully to have a stress-free pregnancy, but also then go into beyond that postpartum phase um, and use those tools, pregnancy and beyond. So yeah, I, I love that week. <laughs> yeah, I love that week too. And, and what they're speaking about is that support group that we talked about earlier and how they, they spend the whole week talking about mental capacity while you're pregnant and giving you tools to help you go into that postpartum after birth um, section of your life as well. When you take Fit for Baby, it's a six week program, but we actually have multiple programs for Fit for Baby. In other words, you could go through six weeks with us and join again for another six weeks and you'll have different information, different resources. It follows the same guidelines but we're providing it for you in a different way. So new recipes, new mindfulness exercises, new breathing information, new information about movement. It updates every time you come take Fit for Baby with us. So no experience is going to ever be the same except for one aspect of Fit for Baby that will be the same. And I'm gonna show that to you now. This is what we call our bump book. And our bump book is something that you can go through, fill out and take with you on this journey through motherhood every time you come take Fit for Baby. Our bump book is going to follow you through the six week session, week by week. We're gonna make sure that we keep up with how big your baby is each week, which is also so fun to be able to contribute and tell people about. You have a section in here where you can actually write a letter and fill out information to your baby before you head into each one of your weeks. What makes this amazing is that if you take one Fit for Baby program for six weeks and you sign up for a second six weeks, you can go back and actually compare your answers so you can see your own personal journey through all of your trimesters. Our bump books stay the same, but your answers are what changes. So while we give you new resources and new information every time you sign up for a program, you give yourself the answers in this bump book, allowing for you to have a scrapbook that follows you through your entire experience being pregnant. All right, guys, we are about to wrap it up. We wanna thank you so much for joining us today. As our final question, I would love to know from you ladies, Rebecca, what do you think that mamas are searching for and needing right now? I really think that mamas are wanting wellness autonomy. We are looking for opportunities to really better understand our own health and our own wellness, whether that in the case of Fit for Baby is knowing why we do that exercise because it helps us with labor prep or whether it's how, you know, tools to prioritize self-care or just an amazing recipe that makes us feel good. We want that information, you know, for ourselves, but also because I think, we have a real focus now on being a health, uh, being a healthy example to our families. Um, so I think that we want all the information and I love that Fit for Baby gets to give us so much of that juicy content that we're, we're really looking for. Awesome. And Allison, what do you think moms are searching for right now? I think community. Um, moms need other moms, um, especially during times of major life transitions like pregnancy and having a baby and during this time, yes, you need your doctor, you need your partner, your family, but um, you need other moms too. And that's perfect. You need other moms and we are those other moms for you. So just to review, Fit for Baby is our six week program that you can join at any stage of your pregnancy. We're gonna take you through one to two workouts every week. That workout is gonna consist of cardio, strength, core, as well as birth prep so that you are feeling strong and ready to roll throughout your pregnancy. 
We also have a support group where you're going to be with those other moms that you're working out with. You're going to get to connect with online every day as you go through this process together. We'll be talking about physical health. We'll be talking about nutrition, mindfulness, as you just learned, which is so big, that mental fitness aspect of being pregnant. We'll talk about joint health, emotional health, and getting you ready for your next steps forward. We'll give you this beautiful bump book as well so that you can follow along throughout your pregnancy and see where you are changing all the way through, keeping it as kind of a scrapbook at the end of the session. Most importantly, every time you join Fit for Baby, you're gonna get a new experience, learn something new, get a new recipe, a new resource, meet a new mom who may turn out to be your best friend or your kid's best friend in the next few years. Because we at Mom, we are, or Fit for Mom, we are here to support moms. We are making sure that we bring together a community of strong moms united in motherhood. If you have any questions about Fit for Baby, you want to connect more with any of our franchisees, please take it over to fitformom.com where you can find a Fit for Baby class, a Stroller Strides class, a Body Well class, a Body Ignite class, or any of all of the above in your area. We have a plethora of formats to offer for you depending on your age and stage and needs of motherhood. Thank you ladies both for being with me here today. Rebecca from Madison, Alabama and Allison from Oak Park River Forest. Thank you ladies so much for being here, being representations of Fit for Mom. Thank you guys for tuning in and watching us and we hope to see you in a Fit for Mom class sometime very soon. Bye everyone.